It's good to be back here. A lot's happened since I was last on this stage. Uh, I was in a coma. Um, people say, well, I have been asked, you know, how do you write your shows? And I'm like, I don't. I just wait. And how lucky was that coma? <laughs> you can't buy material like that. I actually woke up weird after the coma. Uh, just for three days, I was in a really vile mood. Uh, I was just an asshole. And um, my doctor explained it. He said, um, it's because my, I was in organ failure and your liver, apparently, is your anger organ. And <laughs> that made sense, because I woke up livid. And... <laughs> I remember I was taking everything personally and this nurse, she said to me, and I must have looked shit out, so, and she said, and what did you used to do? What? What did I used to do? And out of my mouth came this. I said, oh, I used to blow sailors. <laughs> down by the wharf. <laughs> During the war. Which war? Both wars, you dumb bitch. Um, <laughs> but then I cheered up. Uh, and it was about four days later, I was at the Austin Hospital uh, here in Melbourne, and uh, two of my sisters, I've got a lot of sisters, but these two sisters, they played the most extraordinary practical joke on me, which is a weird thing to do to someone four days out of a coma. Um, anyway, th they were talking into their wrists, the pair of them, and... I, <laughs> The names are Emily and Kate. So Emily's like, yeah, she's alive. Um, yeah, they think she's going to be OK. And Kate's talking into her wrist as well, my other sister. And she's like, yes, yes, she's in ICU. Yes, she's awake. Yes, she's, uh, they think she's going to be OK. And I'm lying there. I'm like, what are you doing? I'm more like, what are you doing? And <laughs> Emily looked at me and she said, it's the new Samsung microchip implant. <laughs> We've all got them. And then Kay sat down on the bed and she said, you do know you've been in a coma for seven years. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah.